Well, well, today is a whole different arena than the season. I mean, the season was we were two and six, and we got our act together. You know, and we did everything right. You know, we didn't make every play. We didn't get every clutch hit, but we got a lot of them, enough to win 13 in a row, including today. And uh, you know, after warmups and seeing their teams, and uh, I felt really good about our teams and how our conference and district and the eastern side side of the state prepares us for today. I thought we were. I think the teams we played are right there with the other team today. Is that, is that as well as you guys have played defensively, especially given the stage? Um, no, we dropped the ball and left. That bothers me, you know, and that gave them an extra bat. But we made the play five to four. So Patton has a hamstring issue. Mm -hmm. He'd be a regular player. We subbed Lewis because he's a healthy young kid who can cover a lot of ground. He covered a lot of ground on that play. All right, he just one handed and the ball dropped. But like, who'd you have out there in the last inning? Coacher. Okay. All right. So Thank you. it wasn't a kid. Right. Uh -huh. And the Leiden subbed in that spot and killed Lewis and killed Pat and re-entered the bat. Right. But for you guys follow baseball. You know how big it is for Coacher to get through the sixth. Mm -hmm. All right. Because if that's the spot, that's the second spot. We don't want Leiden to bat. Right. If we have to go to him for two outs in the sixth, that means he has to bat because we're giving him the ball in the seventh. Mm -hmm. All right. So, um, so, I mean, really gutted it up to get through the sixth. And, you know, he went behind in the count a couple times. But he really, like, must have said to himself, I can't do this. I can't do this. But he pitched better t today than he did, like, in a lot of other big games, you know. But he's a kid. He's sort of a glider. He doesn't show a lot of emotion. I'm a Philly fan. I saw Bobby Abreu play. <laughs> Bobby was talented and everything else. But he just sort of didn't change his demeanor. Nick has a and lot of similarities. Yeah. Nick, Nick has a lot of similarities where he's like a quiet leader who's been around. He's not afraid of limelight. He starts on a basketball team. They play in front of big crowds. You know, like he's not afraid of a big spot. And he had a nice hit today. And he's on base a couple times. So we were able to use courtesy runners and, you know, get guys. And that guy, that spot scored twice, I think, Cavalli scored.